Well, soon SpaceX plans to launch the first mission to orbit the Earth with private citizens exclusively. There will be no professional astronauts on the three-day flight. News 6's James Barbera reports the Inspiration4 crew is expected to arrive on the Space Coast this week. And liftoff. Cargo Dragon takes flight. The next time a Falcon 9 rocket and Dragon capsule launch on the Space Coast, there will be people on board. However, Inspiration4 is unlike any SpaceX astronaut mission before. The first all-civilian mission to space. With Jared Isaacman, a billionaire Embry-Riddle graduate. And immediately I said yes. Haley Arsenault, a St. Jude's physician's assistant and child cancer survivor. Yeah, that's pretty amazing. Cyan Proctor, a science teacher who nearly became a NASA astronaut a decade ago. Talked to my wife and said, honey, I, I'm going to ride a rocket. And, and Chris Sembrowski an Air Force veteran and the second Embry-Riddle graduate on the crew. Their mission, three days orbiting the Earth on autopilot, never accomplished in human spaceflight with exclusively civilians. I think you're sort of seeing just the start of what that dream could be. Space reporter Miriam Kramer says the big picture of private spaceflight is space for everyone eventually. Aptly named, these four give inspiration to that vision. If you hear Jeff Bezos talk about it, millions of people living and working in space, or Elon Musk wants a city on Mars. Like these are big visions that will require flying hundreds, if not thousands, of people. And they're not all going to be trained professional NASA astronauts. They have to be ordinary folks. The Inspiration 4 crew is expected to return to the Space Coast for final preparations on Thursday. Then SpaceX targets Wednesday of next week for the launch. In Cape Canaveral, Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news 6.